Hey guys, Stefan here, and today I'm going to do a review for you of the hardcover Artisan Books by Flipchat. A few weeks ago I did a review of the Lay Flag books by Flipchat. If you haven't seen that one, you can do it by clicking on the link in the description below the video. I'm going to try to keep this um, review short to not repeat myself too much. We all know that's not going to happen because I rant and rant. But, um, just in a nutshell, Flipchap is a brand new company in Malaysia. They create artisan photo books, which means that they are personalized from beginning to end. Every single aspect of the books can be personalized. And today I want to show you the more affordable range, the hardcover books, which are perfect bound, unlike the lay flat ones that I showed you before. And the reason why you should really try out these books is because despite being a commercial mid-range perfect bound book they really stand out from the other ones because they use premium materials in these books and you have so many options and upgrades to choose from so just to give you um, a quick example you have uh, luxury covers like leather linen uh, matte glossy you can also do uh, debossing on the cover you can choose the fabric and the ribbon color in the book you the the binding is absolutely beautiful and you have four paper options and best of all all the flip chat books come with a free set of five gifts which are basically created from um, pictures in the book and you don't have to pay for these and they come with every single purchase so everything about the books is just very very pretty and personal and i think it's the right time to show you these because as Christmas is coming, if you don't know what to get, the Flipchart books are an amazing Christmas gift because not only they are practical as a photo book, they also look very, very pretty and they make a great gift. So, uh, the two books that I'm going to talk about today, well actually it's one book with three different covers, is the hardcover book, as I said, which is um, Perfect Bound. And I've got here two books, they both have a dust jacket on, but this one is the... The printed hardcover which comes in the matte and the glossy, these are pictures from Oslo. Uh, let me just give you a quick flip through, just to give you a little preview. And the other book is basically the same book but this one has a linen cover. And these are pictures from Costa Rica. So that's again just a few pages from the book. And the great thing about this linen book is that the, the slipcase that I have with it is actually the same material so you can match the, the colour and the material of the box. So it goes in really really nice and comes out like that. So. Um, before I go into my upload shots, let me remind you that I have a voucher code for you. Use the code PHOTOBOOKGURU20 to get 20% off your order. You can use it for any purchase on the website, it's a great deal. And these are the, the three gifts that come with the book. I'm going to show you them in the upload shots in a second. They all come in a little plastic bag and again they are just made from pictures in your book. So let me go into my upload shots now to show you the gifts, the unboxing, the boxes the gift boxes, the cover, printing, binding uh, and the editor and then I'm going to talk to you about the price, delivery and the pros and cons of these books. Let me do a quick unboxing again just like in the previous video. It's really worth showing how well these products are packed and what you get in the box. So the two books came in one box and that's one of the books. And that's the other book with the with the other box and as you can see it's really safe and nicely tightly packed now let me show you the five free gifts that you're going to get with every single purchase from Flipchat so let me open it again just very quickly so you get some bookmarks three with pictures from the book you get some small prints with pictures from the book and you have a DIY calendar that you can put together again with pictures and my favorite one is the tiny little miniature book which is basically uh, a miniature replica of your photo book 
which you can either use as a keychain or um, you know just as a small gift or anything the last one which is not in the actual pack is the dust jacket so you get a free dust jacket with all of these books and it's part of the set of five gifts so these are the free gifts that you get with each purchase now let's go into the boxes and the books so let's start with the black box if you haven't seen my previous review i'm going to say it again Flipchap offers amazing boxes for the photo books. If you don't want to pay for a box, Flipchap is going to give you a free black box, which looks like this. And when you open it, it's going to have a sponge over the book, which I find amazing. And in the sponge, you've got a little slot where you can put the miniature book. <laughs> and that's really, really cute. So that's like a spongy material. And then you can lift out your book and you've got a sponge inlay here as well to keep the book safe so this is basically the box that you get absolutely free for no extra charge the second box is a slip box which i'm going to show you here so that's been nicely packed as well so this is a slip box and basically the book slips out and slips back in it's a beautiful fabric material, there's nothing on it and it comes in lots and lots of different colours and you can match the colour of this to the cover of the actual book if you choose a classic book which is going to have the same uh, fabric material. And the last one is the one I showed you with the lay flat books, is the artisan box which is the most expensive one and that opens like that so it comes off from the top this is the most premium one let's go on to the sizes similarly to the lay flat books these ones come in three sizes which is the 10 by 8 portrait 10 by 8 landscape and an 8 by 8 square once again it's not the biggest selection but it's the most popular sizes out there but they don't have any small or very large books at the moment. Hopefully in the near future they're going to have some more additions to the range. Let's go on to the covers. Just like with the Lay Flat books, the website basically decides the book by the book cover. So when you go to the hardcover books, you are going to find three options, which is printed, classic or leatherette. And when you choose each book type, you will not be able to change the cover later on. So it's basically one book with three different cover options, but it shows up as three different books on the website. I hope that makes sense. So let's start with the uh, printed book. So this is the free dust jacket that came with it. It has a matrix of my pictures from the book. And that's the cover of the book. So this is a matte uh, image wrap hardcover. You also have the option of a glossy cover, which I absolutely love. It's great when you have both options. You can customize it front and back and spine. So I've got an image on the front, some text. I've got a title on the spine and I've also got a picture on the back. The second cover is the fabric cover or linen, a classic one. Again, it comes with a dust jacket with the pictures from the book and it comes in 23 different colors. So it's a huge selection. And as you can see, I managed to match the color to the cover of the box. So the material is exactly the same on the box and on the cover as well. So that's how it looks. There's nothing on the front, nothing on the back, nothing on the spine. It's very smooth and it's a lovely library binding. I would say it looks like your traditional library books and you can match it to the color of the boxes. The last one and most premium cover is the leather cover, which again comes with a dust jacket. And when you take it off, that's how it looks. This one comes in eight different colors. So you have a huge option even for the leather covers. And again, it's completely smooth. It has a lovely texture. Hopefully you can see it. Yes, there we go. Finally, the lights are right. I didn't do any debossing on the front, but you can have a, a title deboss. I'm going to post a picture here so you can see it. If you want Mr. and Mrs. or, you know, initials, names, title of the book, you can have it debossed on the front. There's nothing on the spine, nothing on the back. It feels very smooth. 
It's a leatherette cover in eight colors. So these are your three options for the cover, printed, classic, fabric, or leatherette. Now let's go on to the binding. All of the hardcover books are perfect bound, unlike the lay flat books, so they don't open completely flat. They are stuck together at the spine. So when you open the book, it starts with a beautifully textured paper. It's an empty double spread. Let me see if I can show you there. It's too bright today. But finally it's sunny at least and hopefully you can see that there is a crease in the paper here which basically stops it from breaking and becoming all ugly and tearing so it's, it's a great thing to put into your book so start with a double spread then let's start paging it as you can see there's very very little getting lost in the middle because uh, I show you in a second on the spine it's a different uh, binding method than most perfect bound books And then once we get to the back, you've got the exact same empty double spread with the creased look. And you've got a lovely ribbon for which you can choose the color. And you also can choose the color of this double spread. I think there are four colors to choose from. And apart from that, there is also, let me see if I can show you, a little fabric on the top, which is very rare with Perfect Bound books. You mostly see it with Lay Flat books. So, as you can see, the spine is actually quite long, it's like a centimeter long and that's where it's stuck together. So it makes paging the book a lot easier and a lot less is getting lost in the middle. I have to say that from all the Perfect Bound books that I've seen, this is the nicest binding and it looks uh, handcrafted, it doesn't look like all the mid-range commercial Perfect Bound books. So, let's move on to the paper options. This is another really strong point of flip chap. The hardcover books, which are again the mid-range photo books, come with four different paper types. Now, out of all the perfect bound books that I've seen, I think the most so far was three, where there was a gloss, a silk, and a matte. Now, they offer four different paper options. One is a premium silk white, there's a premium satin textured, and there is a premium matte lamination and the premium gloss lamination. Now in this book I chose the satin texture because I was curious what the texture looks like. It feels very very smooth but when you look at the texture, I will probably need to post a picture here, it almost looks like fabric, almost looks like linen. Uh, I've never seen a paper like this before so it was a very nice surprise and a new addition to the photo papers that I've got here. The only thing I noticed about this book is that the colors looked a little bit dull. So if you look at this page, it should be a little bit more saturated and it should also be a little bit more on the warmer side. And I'm not entirely sure if that's because of the print or the, the paper choice, because in my other books, the, the saturation was absolutely perfect. In the second book, I chose the silk white paper. And now you can see the saturation is absolutely perfect. And this one has quite um, a decent amount of, of gloss to it. It's not a subtle sheen. And as you can see, saturation here is much, much better. And let me just give you a close up. So that's the kind of texture of the paper. It is perfectly smooth, it's a silk paper. If I had to choose, I would probably go for this one just because the colors look so much better. But the texture of the other one was a really big plus for me. I think it was uh, more interesting than the average silk paper. But for some reason, colors look better on this one. I haven't got the laminated papers, but if you're looking for a high gloss paper or a completely matte lamination, you can have those two options as well and there is an upgrade price for those. Let's move on to the printing process. Uh, all of these books are printed using um, a digital printing method. I think the print in this book looks really, really good. I love the colors, I love the saturation, I love the dynamic range. You obviously are going to see um, a digital dot structure 
which is present in all photo books printed on digital printers. That means that the picture is made up of small dots as opposed to a continuous transition of tones. But when I look at this book here, it looks a little bit unsaturated compared to the other book. And I think you should be able to see that instantly when I put the two next to each other. I assume it's more a paper thing because glossy usually is better with the colors. But again, no errors. Uh, if you choose the silk white, I think you'll be very, very happy with the print quality. If you go for the satin, I would probably increase the saturation on my photos before it goes into print to compensate for the lack of saturation. And finally, let's talk a little bit about the editing process. I'm not going to post a walkthrough of the editor again. If you want to see that, follow the link in the description below the video and watch my review of the Lay Flat book where I showed you how the editor looks. I think the editor was quite creative. There were lots of things that I could add. And as you can see, uh, the layout actually look quite uh, minimalistic in this one, but I like that the stylish layout. Lots of nice text. You can use backgrounds for images. You also have some stickers. It works online, so you have to upload all your images and uh, you have to do it while you have an internet connection, so you can't do it offline and upload the book in the end. Delivery was very quick from Malaysia. It came with DHL and it costed £4.95. The full price of this printed hardcover book is $44 and with the code you can get it 20% off. So use the code PHOTOBOOGURU20 to get 20% off your order. Uh, and now let's have a look at the pros and cons of the book. So what were the things that I loved most? Well, to start with, I love how personalized they are. I love being able to pick every little detail of my book. These are the perfect bound books with the most paper options that I've seen so far. They all come with amazing uh, cover options, printed for a standard look, 23 linen colors and eight leather colors. So they all look amazing. I love that the company is giving free gifts with every single purchase. These are not necessarily things that you would buy, but when you get them for free, I think it's a great um, gift. As I said in the upload shots, the binding is absolutely gorgeous. I love the double spread that the book starts with. I love the ribbon. I love the fabric on the top. It pages beautifully and there is a crease here which stops the book from tearing and breaking. So top-notch binding for a perfect bound mid-range book. The box options that come with the book obviously make the experience even better and if you don't want to pay for a box you can get a free black box which is just as nice. Now a couple of things that I didn't like so much or things that need um, fixing or development. Uh, so first of all the editor still had lots of bugs when I was doing these books. Uh, I had trouble organizing my pages, going back to previous projects and um, it froze a couple of times, uploading pictures, things like that. I assume that these things are getting fixed on a daily basis so the more feedback they get from customers, the more fine-tuned the editor is going to be. The books come in a limited uh, variety of sizes, uh, two 10 by 8 and one 8 by 8 sizes, so not the biggest range, you can't create a very small book and you can't create an extra large book either. And finally, on the satin uh, paper in the classic book, as I said, the colours looked just a little bit more unsaturated than in the other book on the silk paper. So my advice would be if you do the satin paper, because the texture is actually really, really pretty and unusual, if you want to do the satin paper in your photo book, I would personally advise you to enhance the saturation uh, a little bit before uploading your images. So these are my thoughts on the hardcover books. I hope this was helpful to you and gave you an insight into what you can do with Flipchap. If you are looking for gifts for Christmas, I think these are absolutely perfect to give away because the, the packaging and just the way the books are presented is so pretty that it fits a celebration or a festive period. If you have any more questions about these books, leave them in the comments below I try to answer them if you want to see more of my uh, travel photography go on to Instagram and follow me guy around the world uh, follow me on Facebook and thank you for watching as always subscribe for more